previously on the PSCA Pro Tour. Brandon Powell is going to be the champion and $10,000 richer at PSCA Tour Stop number one. And I got a little bit careful and slowed the gun down and shot slightly behind it. I took dust off it, but it didn't break. No hard feelings. This week, we both demand a lot of each other um, because we know what each of us is capable of. They're doing really well. Uh, it's encouragement. It's good to hear it from your significant other, especially. I've always taken the approach. I don't. I don't give her a lot of feedback. I don't believe. First of all, as a competitor, I don't want anyone to think that I'm helping her through anything. I try to play this game as fair as possible, and I don't want anyone thinking that she's getting any more coaching than any of the other girls. Welcome back everybody to event one on the PSCA Pro Tour and this week we're focusing our attention on the women's bracket, specifically last year's champion Desi Edmonds. Desiree Edmonds, the 2014 PSCA Women's Champion. She's the 2015 World English Ladies Champion, the 2015 North American Ladies Fit Test Champion and Desi is also a four-time All-American. Scott Robertson will be joining me shortly for our Fioki feature match between Alex Wampler and Desi Edmonds. But first, let's see how both of these women got to their championship match. Alex Wampler finished the 2014 season sixth overall in the money standings, qualified third for event number one, took out sixth seed Tina Jewell in round one by a score of 49 to 31, narrowly beating Jenny Clark 48-46 in the semifinals. Desi Edmonds, seated fourth, the defending tour champ, beat Candace Fowler in round one, 52-30. She beat the number one seed, Janet McDougall, 62-55 in the other semifinal match. So it's the defending champ up against the young up-and-comer with $2,000 in prize money and a championship trophy. Me and Desi kind of grew up together in the shooting world. We've always been pretty close together. So I, I feel really comfortable shooting with her. I honestly wouldn't rather be with anyone else. Me and her are pretty good friends. It's hard because I want her to win and I want me to win, so it's a little conflicting. I, I love Alex, we're great friends. Um, and when I used to live in California, I used to see her all the time, and she's a great shot. Um, so it's always, you know, you, you, I always gotta bring my game when I shoot against her. I know she's always gonna show up and she's always gonna, you know, try her best, and, and most of the time, it's right up there with me. Uh, well, I think I'm a little more technically sound than Alex. Um, she shoots a lot of swing through. Um, and I'm a lot more pull away, um, things like that. So uh, as far as the technical aspect of shooting goes, well, we really shoot completely different. Um, and I, I would like to you know, have confidence um, in my technical ability and, and the soundness of my fundamentals. Um, so I feel like, yeah, if I'm on that day and I'm looking at the bird like I should, that I can beat her. She's more precise than I am. I think I swing the gun a lot more than she does. She knows exactly what she wants to do and when she wants to do it. And I'm a little more instinctive and I, I just pull the trigger when it feels right. As an added bonus for this match, we will be putting on a microphone on. to Desi's longtime there. boyfriend, Zach Keenbaum, an <laughs> avid shooter himself. And these two absolutely love rooting for each other. 3 6 forces her to hit oh, 6 no. 7. 3 7. 7's the easier bird. We both demand a lot of each other um, because we know what each of us is capable of. It's good to hear it from your significant other, especially. We'll be back with the finals when the PSCA Pro Tour returns. The PSCA Pro Tour is brought to you by Promatic Traps, your sport, our passion. White Flyer, world-class targets for world-class shooters. Krieghoff, legendary performance. Rancho Bellas Rocas, home of the Naked Goat. Clay Shooting USA Magazine. Linear Controls, the National Sporting Clays Association. And by Fioki, 140 years of excellence. <laughs> Yo.
Karaoke USA, the official ammunition of the PSCA. This segment of the PSCA Pro Tour is brought to you by Fioki. Welcome back to the PSCA Pro Tour and our Fioki feature match. This is the final match for the championship of tour stop number one. Desiree Edmonds, the 2014 PSCA Women's Champion, and Desi is also a four-time All-American. Alex Wampler finished the 2014 season sixth overall in the money standings, qualified third for event number one. Took out six seed Tina Jewell in round one by a score of 49 to 31. All right, here we go with the menu round. Each lady will call for the pair of targets. They'll have to shoot the one target in order to shoot the number target. Alex gets the one, two combination for three points, no problem. Desi, oh, makes a mistake on the one. Misses it both shots. She's gonna get zero in the first frame. Second frame will be the one, three combination for four points. Alex will get any one of the number four targets in random order on the ones, and she gets the one. Oh no, misses the three. Come on, get out there. Desi with an opportunity to take the lead if she can hit this pair. She's got the one target. Oh, she also misses the three. Alex four, Desi one. We're going to the one four combination. Alex has been having a little bit of trouble with the ones. The ones, of course, are about 35 yards out about twice the distance of an ATA trap target, so not an easy target. She makes a nice shot coming down on that one to pick up one point, takes her to five. Desi hits her one, no problem. Oh no, missed the four. Boy, that is not like Desi. Light, really slow start right now. Both ladies are going to the five target. One five pair coming up. Five is very difficult this week. That five's coming off a tower at about 60 yards out, incoming and dropping really fast. And Alex misses behind that five. Desi, her one five coming up, no problem with the one. Oh, and she also shoots high and behind that five. All right, a little slow start here, six to three, but Alex does have a lead. We're going to the one six combination. The six is about a 45 yard crosser from the right side but Alex cannot get by that number one, unfortunately. Makes a nice shot coming down, picks up one point. Desi on her one six combination, got the one. Oh no, check the gun. Wow, she started out quick making a good move and then just looked at the gun and stopped the barrel right behind it. Seven four, Alex with the lead. One seven, this is the most difficult pair on the field. Alex one seven, oh, right over the top. Doggone it, you can see her just take that gun and just keep on going in the dark, losing sight of her gun and just shooting right over the top of that bird. Desi with an opportunity to take the lead if she can hit the seven, and she does. She takes a little piece right off the top. Referee saw that, Desi with 12, Alex with seven. Desi's gonna have a little bit of a lead going into the speed round. They were shooters first, shortly after, friends eventually roommates, and now Desiree Edmonds and Zach Kinbaum are the power couple of the PSCA Tour. Well, he's great about taking advice um, from people he respects in the shooting industry and he looks up to. I think he looks to me more for just small corrections because he has taught me most of everything I know. Definitely in the last three years, I mean, she's kind of taken the ladies class by storm. Last year, she virtually won every event in the United States. Um, very proud. Affectionately known as Desi, her biggest fan and coach has taught her everything she needs to know. It's funny, because she I tell her she gets the best coaching anyone can possibly get, because as anyone knows in a relationship, when I tell her something, immediately, and then, Right then, in that moment, she's going to do the opposite just to just to make me mad or to be in a relationship. You know how that goes. While living together has its challenges, like throwing things away, like dishes or bags of chips, or we're big snackers, so we tend to have like bags of chips out or coffee cups or that, plates. She's the coffee cup. So. <laughs> I'm just as guilty. She's not a cook. She does not cook. <laughs> Ever. I think she made, I asked her to make a pizza, like a frozen pizza one day, and she didn't even read the direction. She messed that up. But I'm not complaining because she's an outstanding cleaner. She can clean the house very well. So I'm not, I'm not complaining. 
the reward of this partnership is far greater win or lose. Much more from the Northbrook Sports Club when the PSCA Pro Tour returns. Why do the pros think you should start shooting sporting clays? I encourage people to go out and shoot sporting clays, not just competitively, but recreationally too, because it makes a better gun pointer. If you can shoot sporting clays, you can shoot anything. I encourage someone to shoot sporting clays if they have a competitive drive, want to meet new friends, and have some fun. If you're an avid hunter, or even if you're not, and you enjoy being outdoors, and you like shotguns, smell the gunpowder, go out there and give it a try. I bet you love it. Best way to get started in sporting clays is to go to mynsca.com and go out and have some fun. This segment of the PSCA Pro Tour is brought to you by Promatic Traps. Alex Wampler grew up in Antioch, California, located in between Sacramento and San Francisco. Her love of shooting started before her teenage years. I started pulling for my dad when I was little, and then finally I said, you know, I want to try this. I'm tired of watching, I'm tired of scoring, I want to do it myself. She put a 28 gauge in my hand and couldn't take it out. We got her uh, Remington 1100 28 gauge and she went out and shot it. Still in her early 20s, Alex isn't sure how far she will take clay shooting, at least on a professional level. I'm in college right now, so it's a big decision making point in my life. Do I want to focus on being like in the shooting industry or do I want to, you know, have a normal life and shoot for fun kind of thing. And Walter's appetite for sports doesn't stop at clay shooting. And how does she balance it all? I'll weight lift in dark morning, and then we'll go shooting, and then I can go to school, and then I have work at night. Wampler wouldn't be able to balance it all without the support of her dad. My dad, he's my shooting coach, my partner, my friend. You know, we without him, I wouldn't be shooting. She reminded me when we were driving out here was, we're going to have fun, Dad. Don't get too serious. And while her dad does see the fun in all of it, he also worries about his daughter. The biggest worry I have is, is that she's too goal-oriented and she's missing a lot of life. She gives up all the birthday parties, the parties with the kids, so she missed a lot of that. I think she's missed the best parts of being a teenager. As we get ready to start the speed round, it's 12-7 Desi with a small lead over Wampler in what has been a slow start to this championship matchup. Next is a speed round, which is broken up into two frames. Each target is thrown in four second intervals and each hit is worth four points. Perfect score in this round is 40 points, 20 for the first half and 20 for the second. I think we're going to see a change here. One of these gals in this speed round is going to take control of the game. All right, Desi's got the first one. There's the second one. Nice shoot. Good pace, one shot, that's what you need. Uh-oh, she missed that one. Oh, don't that, Desi. She's trying to get too aggressive. That was not a good move. Oh, Got that one. Golly, she actually, what she did is try to load real fast and take one stab at that other bird and threw her off for the next one. So she ended up missing two instead of the one. When I sat down with, with Desi and Zach, one of the things I asked Zach was, what kind of a shooter is Desi? And he said she can be a... She can be a what? Erratic. Erratic. An erratic shooter. Oh yeah, that certainly was erratic there. Yeah. And Alan has got three of them. Fourth one's in the air. Wow, she gets it. Uh oh. Whoa, she's going to do some catching up here. She missed that one, but she actually outscored Desi in that round. 23 24 now. 24 23. Desi up by one. Alright, here we go. Second half of the speed round. We're going to go three through the seven in that order. These birds are worth four points. Desi's got the first one. There's the second one. Here's the five. This has been a tough bird. Got it. Nice and quick. There goes the six. Got the six. Wow. This is for the straight right here. Run the table. Oh, nice shoot. Yeah. We've got her boyfriend. Zach mic'd up over there. Finally. That is now she's going to start putting the pressure on Alex. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, Alex makes a mistake. 
I missed the first one. Oh, the pressure's building. Here comes the five. Got the five. Got the six. Just gotta get this to only lose by eight points. Oh, nice shooting. Saved a potential disaster. She started out missing the first two. I was worried. But she made a great save, picked up 12 points. Make her, make her work. This week's Pro Shooter Profile, brought to you by Fioki. Bill McGuire. Bill didn't start shooting full-time until 2000, but since, he has won a number of events. In 2015, Southeast Regional Champion, and is an eight-time All-American, and a five-time member of Team USA. Bill won the World Sport Track Championship in 2012 and the NSCA National Championship in 2011. He finished the 2014 PSCA season in seventh place. Most important trait to have in being a good shooter? Uh, probably a short memory. Short memory, because you know you miss targets sometimes and you'll let that bother you if you're not careful. So try, try to forget that and go on. <laughs> My favorite meal have to be spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> I kind of grew up, uh, that was my favorite since I was a kid, you know. I'd always tell mama she'd ask what I wanted and I, gotta be spaghetti and meatballs. <laughs> uh, favorite TV show would be uh, Andy Griffin. And I like the old ones, you know, with Marnie. So I uh, always had a good moral, you know. Favorite sport other than this, probably bass fishing. USA, the official ammunition of the PSCA. Why do the pros think you should join the NSCA? I joined the NSCA because I knew I wanted to take my recreational shooting to the next level. Being a member of the NSCA has made me a better shooter because it provides an arena for us to compete. The best part about being an NSCA member is shooting with all my friends. The best part of being an NSCA member is the people, the people you meet all around the country. I think the best way to get started shooting sporting clays is going to mynsca.com, finding your local gun club and instructor, ask a friend for a gun, and go out and have some fun. The PSCA Pro Tour is brought to you by Abel's Ammo. We shoot all we can and sell the rest. Chamber View, see safety fast. Blazer, trigger your passion. RE Ranger, professional shooting eyewear. Zoli, world class guns. Trident Power, a new kind of energy company. Yon2 Outdoors, and by Fioki, 140 years of excellence. This segment of the PSCA Pro Tour is brought to you by the NSCA. Welcome back to the PSCA Pro Tour. We're at Northbrook Sports Club outside of Chicago for our very first event of the season. Side of the 2015 U.S. Open. This is one of the premier shooting facilities in the Midwest. We're on about 700 acres, 705 acres in central Lake County, Illinois, about an hour north of Chicago. The club was brought here from the town of Northbrook in 1989. We have 1,100 members. We shoot a lot of targets, probably three or four million targets a year. We have a good group of volunteers, uh, some hardworking staff. Welcome back everyone to the PSCA Pro Tour where Desi Edmonds has a nine point lead, 44-35 leading into the final round, the bonus round. Here we go, 35, 44, Desi's got a lead. We're starting the bonus round, only four pair left. She used a timeout in the semifinals. Can she use one she in the finals? She can use a timeout. Every game they get one timeout. Yep, so she does have a timeout. Oh, Desi's feeling it now. She's got a lead, she's making some hits. You can see she's settled down some. She's feeling it now. And the pressure's really building for out. Oh no, she missed the six. Two, three, two, three. Three, four. Three, four, okay, that works. Desi just needs to score points in this frame. It's really tough on that one. Six, seven, I like it. Wow, she's really got a tough road now. 
Made a nice shot on the six. Wow, that was a great pair. That was a great pair. Hold it within 11. Alex is not out of this game yet. Uh-oh. Dizzy only scored three points there. Alex does another one of those six, seven combos. We could have a really tight match. I don't mean no peer pressure for me. Can you do please. two in a row? Got the wow. six. Oh my gosh, she did it! She hit the six seven twice in a row to pull within one point. I'm not believing it. Desi thought she had this game in the bag. She thought she had this game in the bag. She is in a really tight spot now. Desi has to go for the six seven. Six, seven. Wow, this is tough. If she misses a six, then Alex would have to only shoot a two. Oh, and she did. I don't believe it. I am not believing Desi just gave up a over a 10-point lead. All Alex has got to do is hit the four, and she is the champion. Come from behind. I'm not believing it. Oh, my gosh. And she did. What an unbelievable wow. come from behind. Desi has got to be absolutely just confused that that happened. I'm not believing that that happened. What an upset. Down 24 with only three pair left. Alex hits back to back six sevens to steal the win from the defending champ. We are thrilled to have the women's winner here, Alex Wampler. Alex, congratulations, $2,000 richer. How does it sound, girl? Oh, it feels amazing. It's so exciting. It's all right. And to beat Desi, one of the best in the business, I'm sure you'll agree. Oh, yeah. It's, I never thought I would beat Desi, ever. Well, they don't pick 6-7. She said you it had, twice, man. Had, she was in the You messed up before that. Just keep playing two threes, two threes, two threes. Keep that points. You're a mess. That puts more pressure on you. Take us through the match. Well, it was a really rough start, and the, the fast targets didn't help, but I was able to pick it up and build some confidence and come back in the end. She kept her composure, didn't she? Uh, Alex, I was unbelievably amazed at your shooting. I mean, at one point you were 17 points behind, mm -hmm. and then you came back to beat Desi in the last frame. I, what was going through your mind when, uh, I mean, we all pretty much thought that the match was decided, and you somehow pulled it out. I mean, what were you thinking? I was thinking 6-7. <laughs> well, you did, and uh, congratulations. That was some amazing shooting, and we're certainly impressed. Thank you very much. Congratulations once again, and we'll see you in Minnesota. I'll we'll see you there. Next time on the PSCA Pro Tour, the tour moves to Caribou Gun Club, just south of Minneapolis, for the second stop of the season. We got to have 6-7, and we got to have it now. Whoa. Got it! Oh, nothing. Six points. Three points and you're going to the finals. Three six, if he hits the three, he's on his way to the final match. Oh. And that's gonna do it from the Northbrook Sports Club. I'm Lisa Hillary, we'll see you next time.